Hey guys, welcome to my yearly episode of Dead Rising 4. Just in case you're first time watching, uh, every year I post one video for Dead Rising 4 playthrough because it's more like a Christmas thing and I don't feel like doing an entire playthrough just right off the rip. I So instead I just do like one video per year and um, it's funny because I always forget about this until like the tail end of December and I think to myself like, oh yeah, I forgot. I do a Christmas thing every year and that's Dead Rising 4. I don't remember I did it last year because I did a family thing, so I I don't know if I recorded it in advance before the uh, Christmas vacation, but this year we're not doing anything, so, you know, I just forgot, generally. So, uh, yeah, let's continue to where we left off. Wes, I'm hearing a lot of radio chatter on Obscurus channels. What's this about a convoy? Obscura's caught the monster, and they're moving it by truck. I'm going after them. I'll patch you into the radio chatter. Should help your pursuit. There's something else. I think Calder might be the monster's name. That sounds like a man, not a monster. I'll look into it. Sounds like someone's attacking the convoy. Can you tell me who? I don't know. Maybe Tom's been? Pretty gutsy for a bunch of farmers. Right. Um, so, I don't remember what it last did, but judging by the area, I feel like this is the first place where you did the Exo thing. You had an Exo suit on. You find another Exo character, like an enemy bad guy. And uh, that's it. That's all I can remember about this area. So, story-wise, I don't know how... I think it's still pretty early on, judging by the chapter thing, or I guess they call them cases, not chapter. So I think I just finished case two on the last video, so I should be on case three, unless, can I check anywhere? Where am I in the story? One, two, yeah, right now I'm in three. Just getting science. Okay, uh, let's find a vehicle or something to drive through, because I do not want to just run across a whole sea of zombies. Alright. Wow, that is a lot of zombies. Just gonna just gonna keep going this way to my objective. Are you a survivor or are you a bad guy? I think you're a bad guy. Wait, was that a helicopter? Oh my god. Where did you come from? Pretty powerful weapons, but the durability is really low. There should be a way to upgrade mm, it through your sure skill tree, I think. But yeah, kind of sucks for now. I'm still case three, so it's pretty early on. What the hell's going on over there? Clear out the shelter. Oh, got some Molotov cocktails. Oh, what are you doing here? I guess he's dead. Uh, can I throw this? How, how do I throw cocktails? Uh. 
Oh, hold on. I got something special. Oh, it's a musket. Hold on. Also got a flare. Does that work good in crowds? I don't think it's a thing. I think it's to craft with something else that can blow up stuff. Like a... Oh, hold on. Now let's have some fun. There we go. That'll help out. Okay, so they are bad guys. Some bad shit's going down. Is there a back entrance? Nope, can't climb that. That's weird. Oh god, you're here. Just gotta get away. Fireworks, where are you? gonna die and there you go car I got a Santa present thing what is that gruff and tough motors locker key cool Some more health stuff. Snacks. All right. Got more snacks. More snacks. What is this? Newspaper. All right. I'll take that. Can I drive this? Just wondering. Is there a blueprint? Because sometimes when you find something special, there's like a blueprint next to it so you can craft something new right on top. Wait, hold on. Never mind. For a second, I thought my ejection was behind me, but is it right ahead? What is that? Oh, it's just another shelter. I think I'm fine for now. Should be good. Even though the more shelters, the better, but... Yeah. I should be fine. Ooh, that looks better. I'll take that. Back in the minute car. Here we go. 
All right, gotta gotta open it. Brad, I found the container truck. There's something not right though. I'm gonna investigate. Don't get eaten, Frank. Good advice. Thank you for that. Hey, you, lend a hand, will you? Oh God, you're Frank West. Look, uh, I'm in bad shape here. I need morphine. There's some at the North Peak safe house. You grab me a few hits. I'll tell you what we were hauling. Deal? Deal? All right, all right, I'll think about it. Fine, just hurry. Right. Go to the emergency shelter. Let's go. Let's get the rumors. I think that's for like another mini boss. Yeah, I think in the Dead Rising universe, they're called maniacs or psychos when there's like people that are just super crazy, so they're bosses. Pretty interesting concept, considering that they're not infected people, they're just mostly just crazy ones that like want to embrace the apocalypse I think Dead Rising 3 in my personal opinion had the best of them I liked a lot of those fights they're pretty interesting looking but I feel like a lot and a lot of the Dead Rising community feels like the second game might be like the best one out of this series I like 2 and 3 they're pretty close even though I haven't played 2 as much as 3 Man, do you remember Dead Rising 3, how, like, how big that was and the, you know, the amount of hype that the reveal brought in? It was like the, it's like one of those games that came out with the Xbox One, I think. Either it came out with the console or it came out soon after the console dropped. Hello, blast from the past. Classic weapon. There are a lot of zombies up there just dropping down like flies. Is that saying? I wonder, are they one headshot kill away? Oh, they are. I can't move. I'm still. Oh, there I go. That was weird.
There we go. That should be all of them. Or not. Oh, there's a downstairs. Snowman. You're viral. Did it. They're all dead. I guess the shelter has like an automatic lock whenever it detects zombies somehow. Like it knows the difference between zombies and people. But you guess in this universe where an apocalypse happened on some states, they get that stuff prepared. They have the technology to be able to know which is which. I recognize that poster. That's a very niche reference. Do you ever get to relax? So uh, what do I do now? Search for the morphine. Oh, okay. So it's downstairs. Morphine. Where can I find the morphine? I'll take that. A fresh clip. What's this? Clip. Magazine. Sorry, I don't know the difference. Clearly. Bon bomb. Where's the goddamn morphine? That's a microscope. Oh, there it is. Change clothes. Oh, no. I'm fine here. Just trying to get the Christmas spirit. So there's a vehicle vendor, I think. I should be able to buy something cool. Got like a lot of money on me. What you got? Santa's little You're melter. Supplies. Wait, is it buy once and it destroys or is it like buy once forever? Happy to help. I think I have to buy each time. That's a lot of money. 8,000. Can I craft anything here? I want to make sure. Don't want to leave empty handed. What's that? That's an umbrella. No crafting. Nothing at all. What's this? Grove and Tough Zone Zombie Safe Key. Augie stick, can I do anything with this? Can I craft anything? Liquid nitrogen. Car exhaust. Propane tank. Man, there's really nothing to craft? I probably did not get a lot of blueprints. I need a knife to uh, make the ice sword again. Oh, I got slicing everything. Oh, god damn it. Open up. I cannot control this. West. I'm sorry, I can't see so good. 
Oh, yeah. You're a good man, West. But look, I, I can't tell you what we were hauling. But I can say that Command, they were calling it a recovery op. We were shipping it out of town for R&D purposes. Interesting. Okay, if you find a blanket, or some booze, yeah, I just... All Investigate right. the wreckage. Now what the hell is going on here? This door was punched out from the inside. What the hell did this? Absolutely no idea. But whatever it is, it's Godzilla strong, has friends, and sports a serious hate on for Obscurus. I'm gonna... What was that? My Pulitzer. You gotta go. Now, where did you run off to? I didn't hear anything. Either it was bugged or it was way too far away to hear. And I forgot my motorcycle. God damn it. Just gotta help across now. leads into the old sewer tunnels. Brad, you there? Shit. Don't worry, Frank. Nothing bad ever happens in the sewers, right? Yeah, right. Nothing bad. Just, you know, watch out with the big lizards. And the lab codes. Trying to protect some sort of weird alien artifact. I thought you were dead. I know I'm going the right way. Great! Great! Oh no. Get away! I, I can't move, why not? Oh, 
My god, they're just chasing after me. Sure sound pissed. Oh shit. Hey, hey, I was just uh okay. Defeat the strange like zombie. zombie. Good, good, nice, super weird zombie. Take this, take that, you goddamn fiend. Oh, struggle beam. dead oh there's more oh there's gonna be a lot more what the hell are you kidding me gun ah, worst threesome ever oh great now you have pissed them off Oh, that is not fair. Oh, come on. Gonna be an on the record conversation, Dr. Blackburn. Tell the ZDC I want to be evacuated by helicopter in the next 48 hours. In exchange, I have information. I'll see what I can do. Until then, why don't you whet my appetite a little? I didn't start the outbreak, Mr. West. We were here long before that, years before. Do you remember a certain scientist by the name of Doctor? Dr. Blackburn. Hmm, that did not sound good. No, no, it didn't. Take a shortcut. Frank, I just got word that people are being held prisoner at the pirate ship in Caribbean Cove. Better go check it out in case they do sound crazy. This should be interesting. All right, guess I gotta find my way through this. What if I just hop around? Is that a working car? Defeat the maniacs. Damn! 
championship to paint! You know, I probably talk about this every single time I play Dead Rising 4, but it's still a damn shame that this game was so rushed in development. I think it was made like within a year. I thought I read somewhere where that was like pretty much their time to make this game. And you know, for one year, it's not bad. But you know, obviously, if you give them like another two years, it could have been a lot better. Cause see, if they if you can get this thing. Like the way it is now in a year, then uh, just imagine more like normal development time. It begs the question, like, is there ever going to be another Dead Rising game? Dead Rising 5? Is it possible? Sure, yeah, it is. Definitely possible. But will we ever get it? Maybe. And next... I want to say... I want to be hopeful and say that within the next 10 years, we'll probably get another Dead Rising game. Like a real good one that they spend time on. Because this game came out like... A long time ago so I want to say that if we ever get one like another one they're probably in development right now and this is just me saying all this without any prior knowledge or research to see if there's, if there's been like any like inside information or any leaks if there is gonna be like another Dead Rising game because I don't know I didn't look anything up I'm just assuming they might get another one because Dead Rising is a pretty big series <laughs> Event nearby. Oh, there's a bunch of soldiers. Never mind. Don't want to be part of this. Not my business. Hey, Brad. Can you arrange a covert evac for an obscure scientist? That would be my pleasure. In the meantime, I caught another one of Vic's reports. Take a listen. Heard the ambush ended with gunfire. I have no idea if Hammond made it out alive. The end justifies the means, right? Using people as resources to get the next piece of the story? I keep thinking, this is exactly what Frank would do. Yes, Vic, I am all the evils in the world. Well, you did leave a helpless man tied up in a dark room 20 feet from a live firefight. Whatever, it was fine. Uh-huh, sure he was. Let me start out the evac. Park out. Skiris has a detachment. Come on. Come here. Give me a gun. Hell yeah. What was that? Bowie knife. <gasps> I can make the sword. Hold on. Make it. Get out of my way. Come on, guys. Give me a break. Battery time.
Hell yeah. Man, you can level up really quick in this game. I'm pretty sure I was like level 20 or 21 when I started. Definitely not conspiring with a paramilitary group. Not doing that, Vic. It's not what I'm doing. And I'm not torturing a woman for a quote while a bunch of trigger happy jarheads guard the door. I'm not doing that either. That's Get not me what out I'm doing. Shut up! It's not what I'm doing. What are you doing? Because I'm having a hard time seeing it. I am trying to figure out who these soldiers are working for, how the outbreak began, and what these assholes did. You sold out Hammond and her people. They almost got killed. Do you know that? Are you aware of that? The commander issued a no-kill order, and then Tom's people attacked first. And you believe that? How fucking naive are you? Hello? Shut it! No, 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 I know what this is about. You're trying to get the big story, right? The big scoop. <laughs> This is what this is all about for you, isn't it? Just take what you want and cash the check. Get out of here, rookie. Poacher. That's all you'll ever be. Yeah, sorry about my student. She's like that sometimes. We need to get out of here. They could come back. Who was that? Friend of yours? Just some troubled youth. What do you want to tell me? Our research at Obscurus, it's all based on a project that was abandoned 15 years ago. 15 years? The fuck? That's back to the original outbreak. Yes, this project was performed at a secret laboratory hidden somewhere here in Willamette. And let me guess, Obscurus has been looking for this secret laboratory. Obsessively. The work that went on there, it has the potential to change the very nature of human existence. Wow. Shit. Here, look. Take a picture if you want. Yeah, what is this? Is that a dummy or a real person? Let's see here. Uh, okay, I'm trying to take a picture of something. Oh, that. Holy. That's Dr. Barnaby. He basically created zombieism. The secret laboratory and the research project were both his, and both were abandoned on his death in 2006. You know where the lab is, don't you? We were colleagues for years. I swear on the soul of my SLR, if you tell me where the lab is, I will buy you a helicopter. Then go to the Golden Apple Winery. Barnaby built it as a front to hide the lab. Look in the cellar. I'll do that. But I have one more question, Dr. Blackburn. What's with the cat? What? No, oh, he loved that. Oh, cat. Now listen, all the fighting will have attracted the horse. There's an exosuit in the other room. Put it on and draw them off so I can escape. Exosuit? Go. You said exosuit? Okay, I'm on my way. You have got my attention. I just grab all my ice swords and, you know, now I think about it. How many skill points do I got? Do I got a lot or a little bit? I leveled up like five times, I think. I have six skill points. Okay, what can I use it on? Survival, brawling. How about more durability? Is that here somewhere? Increase durability of blunt weapons. What about blade weapons? Here we go. How do I get that? Level 40 requirement. That's a long way. That's like 10, 14 more levels, I think. Yeah. Damn, that's a long way. Increase the effectiveness of the ice based critical hits with melee attacks. Okay. I'll take that one. Acid base. I don't do acid. Increase the durability of all vehicles. Nah, I think it's fine. Fortitude. Increase the speed at which stamina recovers. Wait, can you run this game? Like sprinting run? I must have forgot. It's been a while. Like quite literally an entire year. Reduce the amount of damage taken from gunfire. 
Don't mind if I do. Increase the speed at which health regenerates. Okay. So how do you sprint? What's that button? Oh, wrong button. Oh, that's you sprint. Okay, cool. Good to know. Blueprint. Deck the halls. Shouldn't be too hard. Oh, I got two infinity gauntlets. You'll find what you're looking for in that lab. Now it sucks that there's like a time limit on it, but I'm pretty sure I can oh, extend it with the upgrades. I'm in business now. Oh baby. Go. I want to get out of this town. Yeah, hold on. You grab a weapon. Where's your miniguns and your flamethrowers? There's a lot of craftable stuff here. Okay, hold on. Um, all right, can't open that. Let's just go. I'll sneak out back while you draw them off. Oh yeah. Now we're playing with power. Attack using X or right trigger. Better and better. Wait, where's the exit? I'm already out of time. I like spend half the extra time looking for an exit. I should probably go back for more extra stuff. Running out of time here. That's right. Let's rumble. Any more power-ups? Can I get the ice thing again? No, I don't think so. Alright, well that kind of sucks. Is there any more power-ups around here somewhere? What is this thing? It's like a satellite. Wait, hold on, there's a minigun here. Drop the other guy. God damn, that's a whole fatality. Oh, come on. All 
Alright, now it's out. Brad, I'm headed to the winery. Hopefully it should contain the evidence you've been looking for. Roger. Come on, guys. It's a new ride. Damn it. Yeah, I'll take a look whenever I feel like it. Which is not now. Shit. Obscurus is here. What's that wine? I'll take both. You see that? Man, you're dead. That was fast. Whoa, what the? Where'd you come from? Dude, give me a chance. Just give me a chance. Am I dead? No, I'm not dead. I'm just, I'm just stuck. Screw you guys! Now, if I were a secret lab, where would I be? I think it broke my neck. I can't move. All right, well, I guess time to load the last checkpoint, which should be probably in the same area, hopefully. Here we go. Okay, I think they have not caught me yet, which is a nice bypass. Ooh, newspaper. I think the lab should be somewhere underground. Secret entrance somewhere here. Oh, man. Kind of feels like I'm playing Outlast. The whole night vision camera. What happened to you? Are you a zombie or are you just a person that died? Dog ear this one.
It's gotta be somewhere down here. Oh wait, the trail. Wait, was there a trail? Hold on, what if I follow it? Okay, it goes down this way. What the hell happened over there? Oh, the trail shows literally on the mini map. I could have just looked down there. Promising. Hello, gun. Hey, Brad, I found the lab. Obscurus was already here, though. They leave anything behind? Yeah, maybe. Ooh, a sword. I'll take that, and I'll make another ice sword. Thank you, MacGyver. Okay, investigation. Put away for safekeeping. Obscurus sure does love files. Barnaby's IT guy is gonna be pissed. The files are all gone. Shit! Mr. Flamel, what the fuck is this? Huh? <laughs> I guess Barnaby really did love his cat. Barnaby's computer stuff. I ever love to get my hands on that. <sighs> Damn it. It looks like Obscurus confiscated everything. Makes sense. They keep it in some kind of intelligence lockup. Probably at the base. Oh, right. So all I need to do is penetrate a fortress filled with trained assassins and steal their shit. Great. Well, hold on. There's another door. This better work. I wonder. F L A M E L. Barnaby, you huge idiot. Holy shit. Okay. Pictures. Lots of pictures. Ah, oh, come on, Frank. You know you're not supposed to walk in there. Looks all weird and sketchy. You guys are in trouble this time. I am prepared. What? Oh, come on! Don't 
those are a lot of zombies pouring in. I was not prepared for that. There's no escape. System rebooting in two minutes. God damn you, Barnaby! Just gotta keep surviving. Oh no, oh no, oh no. That was a bad idea. Level 29, close to 40. Final. Time to get the F out of here. Some kind of new zombie, smart zombie, murder zombie? I don't know. Note to self, come up with a better name than murder zombie. Then I was contacted by Dr. Diane Blackburn, an obscure scientist and a one-time associate of Dr. Barnaby. Yeah, you remember that old fruit, right? Basically invented zombieism, died years back in the original Willamette outbreak. His personal notes and research were never found. Blackburn told me about a secret lab up at the Golden Apple Winery. I checked it out. Weird science, weird zombies, weird, weird, and more weird. Basically, I got nothing for it. Obscurus had already taken all of Barnaby's files. Whatever he was working on, Obscurus wanted it bad. Real bad. And that means it's gotta be real good. Case three solved. Total progress. Well, now I feel like it's a nice place to end it there. I'm pretty sure I only do like one case per video just to make it more neat. And uh, yeah, guess I'll um, end my yearly Dead Rising video for now. And I'll be back next year for some more Dead Rising 4. So until then, I'll see you in about T minus 369 days later. Bye bye. Oh yeah, by the way, have a Merry Christmas. I forgot to say that, so I'm going to edit that in right now. Have a Merry Christmas, and I uh, hope you have a good holiday and New Year's.